When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much, but I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team, professionals, the kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. What else can you tell me? My wife was... murdered. She was trying to keep them from taking Sean, and they... They just... It's okay. You don't need to say anything more. So, we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers. But they waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. Anything else you remember? We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It, it was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. It's a lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. Anything else you remember? We're looking for my son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the Gunners. And of course, there's the Institute. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. Discarded prototype, anyway. Don't lie to me, Nick. You're one of them. They made you. Yeah, I've heard it all before. You're a freak. You've got something to hide. Blah, blah, blah. But the truth is, people smart enough to build something like me are smart enough to cover their tracks, and arrogant enough to throw their unwanted trash into the Commonwealth to fend for itself. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? One of them came right up to me. Bald head. Scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? No. They never said their names. Hmm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. It's Sean. It has to be. Somehow. Don't jump the gun on me. You said you were looking for an infant, remember? That's over nine years difference by my count. Look, maybe he has a son of his own. Maybe it's someone else's kid. Either way, they both vanished a while back. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am.
didn't want Ellie to hear this, You're but I think you should know. I don't know. Everything I dug up oh, about Kellogg wow. before his You're disappearance? Tall. Bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies, because they're all dead. Except you. Nine to one odds says he's our man. It's more than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later? Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. That's one heck of a lock. Got something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Lock's really strong. Hey, Valentine. No luck? Guess we'll need to find the key. Stubborn lock, ain't it? See that platform in the distance, near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. Another glass of wine, Wellington. Certainly, sir. Anything for an understand the rest of it. This is what I like about you, Wellington. You know what you are. Not trying to be anything wrong. with the Institute, he'd come running. Do you ever think maybe you could get a man's attention easier if you use softer words, honey? Maybe shout a little less? Oh, that reminds me of this article I'm writing about the mayor's affair with a certain air-headed blonde. Oh, look who it is. What brings you to the mayor's office, huh? What are you doing here, Piper? Nah, -uh. Not until it's in print. You can read all about it in the next issue. If you are done crowding the reception area, Miss Piper, the mayor needs to make time for more responsible citizens. <laughs> I was just leaving anyway. The mayor's receiving visitors as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? I need to talk to someone about Kellogg's old house in the West Stands. Mr. Kellogg's residence? He left town a while ago. We foreclosed on the property and locked it up. If there was something belonging to the man that you have a claim on, you could ask the mayor to hear you out. No guarantees. I'll talk to the mayor then. He set aside time to talk to petitioners all day. Best of luck. No funny business around the mayor. Got it? Mayor McDonough? Ah, yes. I remember you, our new arrival. I wish I was in your shoes, getting to see our glorious city for the first time. How can I help you? A man named Kellogg used to live in this city. I need to search his house. I see. Well, whatever reasons you have, I take my citizens' privacy very seriously. Even after they've left. I can't allow you to invade someone else's home. That's all there is to it. I understand. You have rules. Maybe for the right amount, you can bend them a bit. What? How dare you? I'm the mayor, for God's sake, not some thug for hire. So that's it? You're not going to help? Security is part of what keeps Diamond City above the petty squabbles and misfortunes of the Commonwealth. I can't betray that for anything. Fine. Thanks for nothing. I know it's disappointing, but I have to think of all the people of Diamond City, not just the needs of one person.
Hey, Geneva. I'm sorry, but you're not getting that key from me. Why do you want it so badly anyway? Never mind. Thanks for... Have a nice day. See what you have. Here you are. Still looking for that key? What's so important? Maybe we can reach an agreement? I just happen to have a pile of caps here. A gift? For me? Oh, how generous. Oh, there I go again, leaving a key out on my desk and forgetting to put it back. Geneva. Remember, you didn't get that key from me. Now, if you're actually... Let's take a look around. Kellogg must have left something behind. Well, not one way to hide a room. Well, look at this. All of a Merc's favorite... Gwyneth Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, and cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. 
won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. I wonder if dog meat could pick up the scent. Say, that's not a bad idea. Some dogs out there in the Commonwealth can track a man for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. I want you with me on this, Nick. All right. Let's get that bastard. This is your show from here on out, okay? You say jump, I'll say how high. Take me to him, boy. Take me to Sean. San Francisco Sunlights. Dog meat find something? Kellogg's preferred brand, all right. Okay, boy, let's track him.
bloody bandages. Dog need to track this. Hmm. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? Stout, one of his creature comforts. I'm telling you, that nose is second to none. Okay, boy, let's track him. Attention, assailant. Lower your weapons immediately. Damn. All of a party happened here. Alert. Critical signs. Alert. Critical signs. What have we here? Error.
tracking known mercenary. Exercise extreme caution. What have we here? Error. Another one of his stogies. What do you think, boy? Was this our man? Is this the place? Is he in here, boy? I knew dog meat would sniff our man out. Let's you and I take it from here. Give our four-legged friend a break. Hey. What's the plan? Can't open it from this end. Yo, psst. Got it. Take a look at that terminal. Say the word. You must be turned away. Hey, with machine. <laughs> Okay. 
want me to take a look at that terminal? There we go. Capabilities. Fascinating. Overactive 
sensors, nothing more. No way I could pick this. You must be terminated. Asset. Kellogg. In danger. Defending.
acquired. that terminal a look? Spared hey. no expense, did they? Hey. What's the plan? Grab anything useful. Security's too good. Over here. Good plan. Think you can unlock that terminal? Good plan. Did a decent job locking this down, but if I just... Nope. Bingo. Detect <laughs> Building a collection or something?
sweet. Now, if it isn't my old friend, the frozen TV dinner. Last time we met, you were close. Got it. that it's an op. Sorry, your house has been a wreck for 200 years. <laughs> Never expected you to come knocking on my door. Gave you 50-50 odds of making it to Diamond City. What's that? Couldn't stay away, huh? Just when I thought we were getting along. No way I'm cracking this.
an enemy may be utilizing stealth. How interesting. now. Got it. Hostile sensor yeah, guys, is determination.
Fort Aiken is under instant attack. We are terminating the intro. Initiate Directive Sigma Omicron. Protect Kellogg. 